Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Cristiano or Triple T. And if you're new here, welcome. So today we are headed to CVS, Bath and Body Works, and a few others along the way. So stick around and let's save the world one dumpster at a time. Five below dumpster. Hmm, is that a grab bag back there? Ooh. A hose. Okay, let's dig in. Wow, this hose is so heavy. Oh my god. <laughs> Now that I used all that energy to take this out, I see a slice in it. So <laughs> into the dumpster it goes back. Yikes, this thing is super heavy too. What the heck is going on with this dumpster? A poster. This has to have like bricks in it because it will not move for the life of me. Holy smoke. Took forever to get that. Let's see what's in it. Whoa. Boo. Headphones. Shirt. A hat. I love my dog. Oh, I love my human. I'm gonna die. This is the cutest thing ever. Some slime. I see why this is heavy. There's tons of mugs. All right, I'm just going to grab this bag and go through it with you guys. Worth the struggle. Let's see if I can even get it out now. All right, and that's it in this dumpster. Staples dumpster. Oh, empty. On to the next CVS dumpster. Ooh, what's in there? All right, I'm gonna try and grab those. This is amazing. Oh, look at that pumpkin guy. That's so cool. All right, now that's officially it in this dumpster. Woo! 
This is by far the best score I have gotten out of all my diving career. How phenomenal is all of this? Including this guy, holy smokes. This was from the CVS dumpster. It was in four grab bags that you saw me pull out and all of them had no garbage in it and it was all just these items none of them broken none of them expired literally i don't understand i don't understand and the majority of these things don't expire they're perfectly fine items that are being thrown away and can you just imagine this one cvs dumpster one cvs dumpster out of our entire country even the world i'm sure cvs is worldwide how much more is there being thrown out? Insane. Look what we could save just by one dive. Literally, probably only five minutes it took me to pull this out of the dumpster and throw it into my car. And all these things can be donated to the people who can't afford. And especially those erasers or those pencil sharpeners or anything here. Children need school supplies. Crazy, crazy, crazy. So let's just jump right into it and see what we got out of this dumpster. All right, so we got a cleanse hand sanitizing wipes. These, why would they even throw these out? People want to purchase these all the time still. They expire June 4th, 2022. Not expired by a long shot. And it's still perfectly fine. People are buying those. So why throw that out? Beats me. Two pill pouches. 40 bags in each, a deli basket pack of three. We've got two of these drying mats for your dishes, four of these pink makeup removers, four green and four blue. All of these have expiration dates of September, 2022, completely not expired. I didn't know makeup removers expire, but <laughs> they do, and they're not expired, but they're in the trash. Beats me. Then we have two of these sprays. One says, so fresh, so clean with lemons, and one has raindrops all over them. Super cute, brand new, never used. Then we have all of these Star Wars, um, what are these? Star Wars, like gadget cases, I believe that's what they're called. Yes, Star Wars gadget case by Disney. They were all hanging on this like, I don't know, those things that hang in the store. And the price was $9.95, $10 for each of these. So cute with baby Yoda. So cute, that one's upside down. Let's show you a good one right here. Baby Yoda, aw, adorable. And this one's the Mandalorian, crazy. These are perfectly fine, why throw them out? And they're still like wanted, people want these things all the time. I don't know. Then we have two of these makeup bags. This says, yes girl. And this one says, girl power. It's a very decent sized bag. And it is by Sophia Joy Conair. Definitely not cheap, I wouldn't think. Let's see. It doesn't say the price, but this is definitely like a collaboration with somebody. So it probably was hiked up in the price. Then we have 10 of these Brillo Basic Oxy Blast Stain Removers. Amazing. This is like a perfect cleaner for the house and it doesn't expire. And if it does, maybe that's the expiration date, 2320. But even so, it's cleaner use it it's fine holy smokes great great score then we have two of these strawberry cream cookies five of these lemon cream cookies and five of these chocolate chip cookies they all expire in 2022 we've got a pack of two guacamole bowls four scoring sponges actually only three that was the only thing in this entire haul that was missing 
an item. Everything else is perfectly fine. We got a pack of hair ties, some air freshener, a bunch of these Ticonderoga erasers. It comes with these three uh, loose erasers and a bunch of eraser heads that go on the tip of the pencils. And all of those were $2.99. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of those. We got a pair of fabric gloves. We have this ring that was $7.99. We have two of these hair accessories that says kiss and love and this pearl one, super cute. Two of these hair accessory scrunchies, white and black, adorable. We have this purple squeezy guy that's squishy. Ooh, and lights up. And it was $2.99, I believe, yep. We have this squeaky dog toy and this duster that extends. We have two dog chew toys, a bark box, squeeze me, PB&J and lunchbox um, dog toy. Adorable, super cute, it's connected, and it was 12 bucks. These aren't cheap and they're super cute. Bark to school. How cute. <laughs> anyway, then we have this adorable pineapple cup. We have a pink cup. We have a bumblebee cup as well. And we have two more bigger pineapple cups. We have a bunch of these ice cube trays. These are grapes behind it. I can't reach it, but take my word for it. There's apples and there's bananas. We have three of each kind. We have a container of four storage boxes and it was $5.99, brand new. We've got a Minions puzzle, 100 pieces. We have a $10.99 Paw Patrol book that sings. now that I can't turn the music off. <laughs> anyway, we have that still in the plastic, which is perfect for my daughter. Then we have this pack of walkie talkies still in the packaging. We have two of these orange plastic containers, two of these green plastic containers, two packages of 48 count disposable pencils, pencils, <laughs> disposable utensils, <laughs> Then we have 24 packs of gloves, 100 in each pack. Can you even believe that? Why throw it out? People are still buying gloves. We're still in a pandemic and they're just throwing them out like it's trash. Crazy, I don't understand it. And last year we were purchasing gloves for like $100 a pack and people couldn't find them anywhere. So here now they're just throwing them out like willy nilly. Anyway, I'm glad I could save those. Then we have a ton of these Ticonderoga sharpeners. I think we have about like nine of them and they were $1.99 each. We have two packs of these $2 lint roller twin packs. We have a bottle blender where you can shake up your protein shake or whatnot. And then we have these two water bottles that are 24 hours cold and 12 hours hot. They work just fine. Nothing is wrong with them and they were $16.99 each. Finally, we have this big ticket winner. Woo! This spooky pumpkin guy. Super cool. You would think that he's broken because you know, he was in the trash. And even if he was broken, he still looks great because Halloween, things can be spooky and like ripped up. But honestly, I think this is how he came and he works. Let me show you. Look how cool he is. Super spooky. My God. I wonder if he turns off or if he just continues speaking like that. Oh no, there he goes. It must be motion activated. 
pretty cool. I love it. Anyway, great score. This was a fantastic dive. Honestly, who can ask for anything better? They were all wrapped. Oh, that one fell. <laughs> they were all wrapped. No garbage in the bags. And they were all just laid there ready for me to take out. It took me five minutes to get these four grab bags. Nothing was destroyed. Fantastic score. This is the grab bag from the Five Below dumpster. It was so extremely heavy. Let's jump in and see what we got. We got, oh, this is cool. A little Steve light from Minecraft, I believe. Interesting, that's cute. This I showed you it by the dumpster. Oh my God, am I so excited to try this. I am definitely going to put these on. One on my dog, Bella and one on me. I cannot take it. It's so cute. I love this. <laughs> then we have, let's take this out first. Ooh, this is heavy. Chef's slime. Whoa. Oh boy. My daughter is going to be so excited. Oh wait, I thought these were already made. Uh, maybe not. They're very liquidy. Hmm. Unless this is the consistency of their slime. Ugh. That's going to be a mess. Interesting. Okay. Either they are bad and that's why they threw them out because they were all like liquidy or this is the consistency of their slime. Interesting. Well, we've got a box of slime. Then we have another little thing of slime, crystal clear slime, way more slime-like texture than the other box. We have a pair of headphones. This is LED gaming headset. It is inside. We have that t-shirt that I showed you. What is it actually? It looked odd when I was looking back at the footage. Hmm. Not quite sure what this stands for, but it looks like an orange like speaking bubble with a heart exclamation point. <laughs> Interesting. All right. Still can be used and donated. This is a candle. Wow. Smells good. Cranberry Prosecco. Nice. I love finding candles, especially ones that are not broken. We have, I'm leaving these boxes for last. Oh, here's the candle cover. We have, is this a painting of some sort? Or wall decor? Ooh, this is like for Halloween. Neat, and I think there's a button. Oh, there's no batteries in it, but wow, that's gonna be really cool hung up because it's gonna light up and look like the moon. I love this. Cool find. I'm such a Halloween girl. <laughs> I'm gonna insert a picture of me, my fiance, my daughter, and my dog all dressed up for Halloween. We weren't spooky, but it was quite adorable. So let me know what you guys think of it. Because as we were walking ar around the mall trick-or-treating, they all said we won the best group costume. <laughs> and it was super easy and affordable to make. Anyway, next we have, ooh, that's broken, but Rose Apothecary, handcrafted with care. 
Interesting. This is a mug? You would think that handcrafted with care would be like a candle. But I guess mugs are handcrafted too. But this one definitely does not look handcrafted. <laughs> anyway. So we have a mug with a broken handle. But if you know how to like remove that piece and like shave it down and then re-lacquer it. It's still a good cup. Or like a container to hold like makeup brushes or whatnot. We could repurpose that. Then we have a ball that lights up. I found these before in Five Below Dumpsters. We've got this poster. This one is, oops, of a mystery poster. My Hero Academia. Interesting, it's like a manga book. I used to read those all the time when I was younger. They're like Japanese manga books. It was pretty interesting, it was like comic books. Then we have another one of these apothecary mugs, except this handle is not as broken. I think I saw the pieces in there, so maybe if they're not shattered, I could even glue them back together. So yeah, I actually think I can, so I'm going to try and do that. What else do we have in here? We've got a C cable cord. What else do we have in here? I think it's almost time for those boxes. Um, a luggage tag, but without the little piece that wraps through here. But if you really wanted, you could use like a zip tie. That would work too. We have some chocolate and it's not open. So like, I'm sure that's, oh no, there it is. But in the middle, there is a toy. So we can just take the toy out. It's a surprise egg. So while pulling out those boxes from the grab bag, I found another one of these shirts and another ball, just a different color. So we've got those and in these boxes are actually a bunch of mugs. So they're all that Rose and Apothecary mug. This one has a broken handle. Let's see what the other boxes have. This one has four mugs, all broken handles. This one actually popped off pretty well meaning like not jaggedy, so that would be an easy fix. So I'm gonna try and fix those up. And then what about the third box? More candles, more mugs with broken handles. Any that are not broken? No, they're all, they're all broken. But you know what? Like I said, if you didn't wanna use it as a mug, oh, that's cute. I didn't notice that there. If you don't want to use it as a mug, you can set this on your vanity or, I don't know, put whatever you want in it and try and shave these ceramic pieces down or, I don't know, be creative. Figure something out. And you can just put, like, makeup brushes in there or sunglasses or whatever you need to hold because the mugs are actually pretty large. They're, they're almost larger than the palm of my hand. So, pretty good. It still would be like a cute little decorative piece on the counter. All right, so let's see what we got all together. All together, this is what we got from that grab bag. So we have two of these bouncy balls, one in blue and one in multicolored, and they both light up, super cute. This set of I Love My Dog Beanie and I Love My Human Beanie for the dog. Super cute. Then we have a Type-C cable. We've got this little surprise egg chocolate guy with a toy in the middle. We have this Minecraft Steve Light. We've got a Cranberry Prosecco candle. We have a luggage tag. We have a gaming headset, two shirts in size large. We have this poster for My Hero Academia. We've got this adorable wall decor that should light up once I put batteries in it. 
we have a crystal clear slime. This whole box of slimes, which I thought were not correct because they were so liquidy, but I opened one up and that's just how the slime is. So pretty good score for that because my daughter asks for slime all the time and I want to die because spending money on slime is like crazy to me. <laughs> and then we have 10 of these mugs. They all have broken handles. They say Rose Apothecary locally sourced, handcrafted with care and have a little rose on the top. And then that's what the other side says. So you can either use it as like a makeup brush holder or any type of holder because they are very large sized mugs or you can try and fix the handles, which I'm going to try and do. I'm going to actually try and do both. So anyway, great score from the five below dumpster.